Hello and welcome to another directed draw. Today we will be drawing a tadpole. So let's get started. All right, so the first thing we need to do is we're gonna draw the head. So the head is like the letter C. So we're gonna go up, around, and down like that. Okay. Let me make mine a little darker. Okay. All right, so from here, we're gonna do the tail. So the tail, I'm actually going to kind of close off this letter C like that. And the tail is gonna come off from here. And what it's gonna look like is it's gonna be thin and kind of like a letter V. And you're just gonna follow that shape. So I did a line out from the head and up. Then I'm coming over here on this side and you're just gonna follow that and then it's gonna get thinner until it comes to a point, okay? So it looks like that. So when you get to that point, we're gonna draw the outside of that tail. So when you look at a tadpole, they have the tail on the inside, but then it has like a very transparent or see-through kind of tail on the outside. To do that, I'm gonna come back up here and I'm gonna go out like this and I'm gonna follow this shape all the way around the tail. It's gonna look like that. I'm going to add the eye up front, and it's just a circle, and it has another circle on the inside, and this one is going to be dark, and you'll color in that after you're done. And the front of the head is actually a little bit pointed, so starting here, um, or actually, I'm going to start back here. And I'm going to kind of round it out a little bit and do that. And then I'm going to erase the original letter C that we had. So it looks kind of like that. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and erase this part since we drew the tail. So it should look something like that. So a tadpole is the first part of the frog's life cycle. And this is how they look. And if you want, you can just kind of do a little curve right here because they're kind of fat. And I'm actually going to extend that out a little bit. So it looks like that. And then I'm just going to add some lines going out on the see-through part of the tail, and there you have a tadpole. 
Now they're kind of brown with some spots. So let's see if we can draw this. Okay. So I'm going to use my crayon and I'm going to color. Don't color the, um, the tail though, just the head. Try to stay inside the lines as best as you can. Okay. So I have something that kind of looks like this. And the tail is kind of a tan color, so, or a lighter brown if you don't have tan, and I'm just going to color this like that. Again, I am not coloring the transparent part just yet. going to try and blend this part. Okay. So the transparent part is kind of orangey yellow-ish. So what I would do is I would do like a tickle touch of orange and just do it very lightly. So as a frog grows, the tail will disappear. Okay, so I have something that looks like that. And now I'm going to go get my um, brown crayon again. That's slightly darker than the one that I used for the head. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do a bunch of spots. So, I can make them big spots, little spots. And they're pretty much very spotty. And these spots also are on the tail part, the transparent tail part, so you can put some there. And just kind of put them wherever you want them to be. Alright, so this is kind of how it looks like. You can add some more spots if you want. don't have to. Um, I'm going to color the eyeball a little yellow. The center of it is still black, but the um, outside part is still kind of yellow. So there you have it. That is how you draw a tadpole. So I hope you guys enjoyed and make sure you're washing your hands, staying safe, and I will see you next time.